Greetings, Daniel Presedo here for Adobe Photoshop CS6 Extended. And today we're going to talk about opacity maps. Opacity maps are textures that provide transparency for your object or create transparency in your object. Anything that's white will be opaque. Anything that's not white will be, start to become transparent. So a gray will be a semi-transparent and black will be completely transparent. Let's create something with a sphere here. I'm going to click twice. You'll see the properties panel show materials and opacity is one of the many materials effects that you can apply. Let's create a new texture choosing the defaults here and now I'm going to open that map up click on the layers panel and let's paint something black on here. So we got a few stripes put some dots and you know maybe we should put something gray in here just to get an idea of, of what's happening with that gray portion. Let's splatter the inside with gray. Save it, close it, and there you go. Your sphere has now been punched holes in within it. And you can see here that there's a little bit of grayness, so it's not completely transparent, it's not opaque, it's kind of a gray there, and it's kind of cool looking in some ways, and look at that. Okay. So, what if you wanted to paint on here? You could actually paint as well on this. Let me uh, jiggle this really quick. Let's turn this on and off. Got a GL rendering, so now I can actually paint on. You can't paint on a ray trace render, but here you go. I am painting with my gray brush, and it's kind of punching a little bit of holes here. Let's turn it black and see what happens. Now we're really digging into this thing. I'm cutting out the entire side here. What you say? There you go. I am. I really am. See? Now, if I were to back up here and say I did not have an opacity map, I wanted to show you this real quick. I'm going to remove this. I'm going to remove this texture as well. So, if you want to paint something, you'll get this dialog that says one or more materials is not there. It's going to create a material for you. Do you want to? You need to have a material or a texture, a map, something there, a layer to paint on. We don't have anything yet, so we're going to say yes. Now I want to paint, so I'm going to paint on this object. And so that's just simply, I'm, I'm painting on the object there. There's nothing unique about that. I'm going to go to paint on target texture and say opacity. Now if I start painting, hey, you're missing a map. Yes, I want to make a map. Thank you very much. Now if I start painting, I'm actually cutting into the object. We're creating a big hole here, and let's render it out. And you can see this hole here has appeared. You can do this with many other textures. There are other areas you can paint on, diffuse, bump, specular. There are a bunch of things to try out here. So I'll give it a shot, and if you have any comments, questions, post them on my channel here on YouTube. Thanks.